What's up YouTube, Deluxe here today, and I'm here to talk about skipping out on Infinite Warfare this year. I played the beta, there was a lot of things I did not like about Infinite Warfare's multiplayer. I'm pretty sure the campaign in Zombies is going to turn out fine, but most of my hours when playing Call of Duty usually go towards multiplayer. A few things I did like about Infinite Warfare were the guns, some of the rigs were actually pretty good, the perk selection, the customization, the graphics are pretty good as well, and that's it. Like Everything else is just terrible the maps have the worst flow ever i hate these maps like terminal's not good even though you know it's a classic map it doesn't play as well as it should sometimes you have enemies spawning right behind you the movement is a bit stiff some of the payloads are actually a bit ridiculous in my opinion like the eraser or the one where you turn into a robot dog i'm like what is going on here and the connections for the beta were terrible i could barely get into a game sometimes man it was ridiculous that's not a great way of marketing your game with terrible servers in Infinity War. That's all I'm saying. Like, you guys need to work on that ASAP. I'm not going to lie. The streaks are fine. They just didn't blow me away. And, of course, there's weapon variants and supply drops, which I'm not a big fan of because I know weapon variants killed Advanced Warfare. But supply drops, on the other hand, you, those you just can't get away from. They're making Activision tons of money. So I'm not really going to complain about supply drops too much. But the weapon variants, that's what's going to trigger me. These different types of weapon variants have all these different types of abilities, which definitely can present an unfair advantage in a gunfight. Whereas in Black Ops 3, sure, they had ranged weapons in those supply drops. But those ranged weapons weren't like, oh, if you, if you had those weapons, you were unstoppable. Because you can still wreck with the M8 or the KM44 and stuff like that and still do fine and not have to worry about those other ranged weapons but in this game that's not the case because you know infinity war is going to be adding multiple weapon variants over time through infinity warfare's life cycle so that could definitely present an unfair advantage for those who don't drop 500 dollars just to get a few legendary weapons and quick scoping is back in the game which frustrates the hell out of me i don't know understand what it is about quick scoping now if you guys love quick scoping that's good for you but honestly i just think it's bullshit especially when i got like an smg or a rifle and it's close range and all you just kill me in one shot with no effort at all i'm not a fan of it and that's really not going to make me want to play multiplayer and i know some of you are going to say but dmlx what about mom for remastered i can just wait for it to be sold separately and some people are going to say well dmlx has only got to be for the legacy edition of infinite warfare i don't believe that i do believe mom for remastered will be sold separately maybe like five months from now and honestly mom for remastered isn't enough for me to buy infinite warfare i mean mom for remastered will probably last me a good two months so like playing the campaign again would be nice sure they add some new game modes to the multiplayer and some new weapons camos but there's nothing else to it they have the same streaks same weapons same perks same maps and it's boots on the ground so everyone that's been calling for boots on the ground there it is but i'm not gonna drop 80 dollars just to play mono for remaster that's not gonna happen activision if you're listening to me and i know you're not can you just try out this formula have trick set call of duty games in the past have infinity war games set in the present and have sledgehammer set in the future that's all you gotta do and i think the community will get back on board with call of duty that's just my personal opinion. You may feel differently. But let me just ask in the comments down below about Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Are you guys enjoying the multiplayer? Like I said, I think the campaign is going to be good and zombies is going to be fun. But when it comes down to the core element of Call of Duty, which is multiplayer, and I don't mind going back to playing Black Ops 3 because I actually really enjoy that game. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, more content to me on Call of Duty and other games in general. I'm Dimalex. I'll see you in the future.